Here is a video that I made trying to help someone who might have suggested that they want to see this. For example, sometimes it's difficult for me to figure out what somebody wants when they don't provide very many details. So in this video, I am going to explain why you could probably do this, but you're not going to be able to do this. However, you could probably do this. So let's go ahead and start with the basic design here for those of you who don't know what a 45 degree angle might look like. And to make a 45 degree angle, just draw a square box and then draw a line from this point to this point. And that's going to give us a shape like this. And then we can take this shape here and put it over here to get started with our stairway layout. And of course, there are plenty of other ways to create a 45 degree angle. So I believe the video that the individual watched was for a stairway design that looked like this. And that is going to look like this one over here. Let's go ahead and zoom in. We basically just have a landing that might be considered a step because this right here won't meet the minimum building codes for a landing, which is going to be 36 inches by 36 inches minimum. And of course, you will need to check with your local building department to verify whether or not you can do this right here. And you might be able to. So if you want to build a stairway like this, where we're just going to add another step by connecting this corner to this corner, and that's going to look something like this over here. And the problem with this one here is that we might not have the minimum walk line depth. And that's usually going to be 9, 10, or 11 inches, depending upon what the stairway is going to be used for. So if we need a little more room here so that we can create enough room for someone to actually put their foot on, then we're probably going to need to do something like this. And that would be to simply extend this section of the landing or two steps to create enough room for the stair walk line. The walk line is usually going to be a line that runs parallel to the inside of the stairway or the shortest distance of the stairway, which would be over here and over here. And it will be 12 inches away from this line here. I do have other videos on that. I didn't want to spend a lot of time on it in this video because I've probably done at least 10 or 20 videos about a building walk line. So not too difficult and I hope it helps. And like I said, don't forget to check with your local building and safety department because they're going to have the final say on what type of design you're going to be able to use to design a stairway with a 45 degree angle or multiple steps. And thanks for watching. Also, don't forget to visit our website. We have an organized list of our videos there. You might have a difficult time finding that anywhere else.